But you're saying the same thing I'm saying because you don't know nobody then, that do then, that. At that point, then it's still in the air. Bro. Okay, so it's stop. Still... So stop saying there's a perfect chick out there if you don't know that. Then the same way I'm saying it's bro, not. That don't stop make saying sense. It is. Nick, that stop don't saying. Make sense, bro, stop. Bro. All right, what up, what up? Welcome to episode, <laughs> goddamn, I don't know, of the In Your Face yeah. podcast. We've been doing this shit for a minute, bro. We don't even got to tell these motherfuckers no more, bro. I, know, I really bro, feel like we don't have to introduce. Y'all niggas know. No, bro. No, no, no niggas know, it, bro. bro. Y'all here. Y'all know. Bro, goddamn, it's us. No, hey, the, it's a brand new people. Top, it's just us, nigga. Yeah, boy, goddamn, <laughs> you know, it's just it, us, it's nigga. Right, yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a brand new person that just that. tuned in right now. In your now. face podcast, I'll kill. For the first time. That's when you get new subscribers. They're brand new. They're like, let me check these dudes out. So now when they come in, they're going to be like, Nigga, it's us. They're gonna be like, hey. who is he? Hey, I'll see the description. Hey, listen. <laughs> listen, first time listeners, last time listeners. Yeah. Like, subscribe, comment. We here, man. Yeah. Us. How is it? How is it? Welcome. It's your man Flawless. Mm -hmm. Next to me is just one the one and only big homie. You know what time it is. It's uh Kev, Big Kev, the goat. It's your boy Kells, aka Whole Juice. Mm-hmm. And today, man, we're going to talk about life, <laughs> life, 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 after fame. <laughs> life after fame. Life after fame. Yeah, man. So we're going to talk about, so are we basically saying, um, we some broke niggas right now? No, nah, we just not famous. Not famous. Ain't got nothing to do with bread. Famous, bro. Oh, this okay. crackhead. So famous, this is nigga. all a hypothetical. <laughs> if we was famous, famous, what would you do after you was famous? After you know, the cloud touch. And you know what's funny? Money has nothing to do with fame. Nothing. Yeah, he just said that. Not a yeah, yeah, yeah. Quite, a crackhead is famous. Yeah, a crackhead is famous. What yeah, they got crackheads famous. They be having them motherfuckers yeah, singing on the subway. Not necessarily, bro. Yeah, like, yeah. You see, they blow up. People blow up from YouTube videos, Facebook mm -hmm. videos. Mm -hmm. Welcome to Great is a great example. Exactly. That ugly ass nigga kissing models. Mm -hmm. Where is he now? Exactly. That sound like hating, bro. No, that's not. Mm. Nah, bro. He, he is an ugly ass nigga. He ugly. <laughs> nah, that nigga, <laughs> that nigga ugly. They might have, they might Who we talking about? Trying, a welcome to great. Objectively ugly, right? These nuts! Oh, that nigga right. got him! Damn, where is that? Uh, yeah, okay, he had his time. Yeah, yeah. he had his time, bro. Oh, uh, yeah, he was smacking some bad chicks. Off of fame. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. Fame alone, bro. No how y'all feel, feel, man? Y'all feel like y'all gonna be uh, the same niggas, or y'all feel like y'all gonna change? I know I'm going to be the same nigga. I know I am. I'm, I, that's one thing I'm not worried about. I think when change gonna come, it's gonna be the bag. Bro, you when the, the first no. nigga to change. Nah, bro, not, 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 I see it, bro. Nah, not for fame. Bro, money. Bro, you be like, fuck y'all niggas, I don't need y'all Bro, not not bro, not I can from fame, bro. bro. Not from fame, I'm telling you. That shit means nothing to me, nigga. <laughs> money might, I might be like, hey, man, a little less of the bullshit when I got the bag, but fame. <laughs> I don't care about fame, bro. I could care less about fame. I don't give a fuck. A lot of people know my name, nigga. I want money. If that, when I can dress and do different shit, then I ain't got no choice but to act different. But not when fame hit me, nigga. I'm just still gonna be in my apartment, a nigga that a lot of motherfuckers know. Like I don't care about that shit. Hey, nigga, man. Money. Money. Yeah, now he got a temper too, right? Yeah, I got a temper like a mother. Let him yeah. let him get famous, bro. Famous? I'm telling he ain't you. Gonna know it. We got, ain't got it's gonna be bro, one time. Time. bro, you literally see us in a club be like Oh, okay. What? Hell no. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> Hell no. Nah. Nah. I definitely uh, I, I, that shit hit me. I'm way too nice. Way too I'm nice. way too nice. And that's just the guy's on the show. I got a temper, yeah, but I'm when I don't know if I don't know motherfuckers. I'm not, I'm not that type of nigga to act funny. I don't do you that don't shit. talk to random people though. I don't. I don't. I just have a problem I with mean, it. I mean, I'm not friendly either. Yeah, I have a problem so with it. So what would you, you do with fame, friendly. bro? What would you do with fame? Fame icon? means you, you know me. Yeah, you a cool dude. What would you, you do with fame, bro? Would, you, would that change you? Do y'all niggas know me, bro? What you mean? Especially so, you, bro. So you said you're not friendly. friendly. No, bro. You ain't me. So bro, do I'm you. cordial, my nigga. Yeah, like, if you speak simple. to me, I'm gonna speak cool. back. That's what I'm saying. You're not nah, bro. The friendly Being is, cordial is no nice friendly guy. is somebody that actually has. You can literally go to a stranger and have conversations with. You can't That's do a that. Hell no. Nah. Are you sure? Do I do I really want to? Are you sure? You want to think like, about I this? You want to think about this? I don't know. Mister Mister Door to Door. 
You can't go and just talk to people. Nah, bro, that's business. <laughs> you can do it. No, bro, that's all I'm saying. Right, that's a, no, you bro, just a, no, like you general, can't talk no, to no, random people. No, business and general conversations is two different things. Yeah. Nigga, if we go, if I, now friendly is somebody going up to you. If you got a neighbor, <laughs> that nigga comes up to you. Hey, what's going on, man? My name Blase Scoop. Oh, you like this? Yeah, 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 yeah. Bro, I don't do that. I've I mean, never but, done that in my life. I don't think you would get into a profession that would take you out your comfort zone. So if you weren't cool with talking to people, you wouldn't take a job that you got to talk to people. But you 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 are mis you misconstruing the whole point. I'm I'm cordial. I can speak to people, but I'm not friendly. You're a nice guy. All right, whatever, man. Okay, <laughs> I, I, I kind of disagree, man. Cause I've been hoop with you a few times. It'd be some random boys on the court. Exactly. That's basketball. That's basketball. That don't mean that you still no, talking to random people. Yeah, bro, 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 okay, bro, communication. Court, bro, communication is to. different from acting like you know the nigga for 15 For real. Years. You go, yeah, what's up, G? Oh, yeah, you from here? That's what's up. Bro, I That's didn't basketball. see you do it, bro. I mean, hooping is one of the first few things. Bro, do y'all, do y'all, do y'all, do y'all, hold on, bro. Do y'all realize that y'all put it everything in situational things? This is not me. No, bro, listen. Basketball? Nigga, I'm not gonna talk to them niggas after we get off the court. Facts. Nigga, I walk right out, nigga. That's the same way. Facts. I do, I am hooping. You can and you say you hoop with me. You see who name one of them niggas I've talked to outside yeah, of that. I was the, thinking. Yeah, it's not oh, no, 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 watch this. Watch this. We was on the lead, bro. Yeah. Did we not be like, all right, y'all? Yup. Soon as the game was over, when we was out the oh, door. I'm talking about that's because we was losing. That niggas was mad. No, I we wasn't mad. Talk to them niggas. No, I was not mad, bro. What? I bro, knew. we got in the car. Oh yeah. We clowning. We clowning. Yeah, we're not mad, bro. We ain't losing yeah. no ground. I was like, them niggas shit. is trash. Yeah, but it's just uh, that's fact. <laughs> That's You're not about to talk to these niggas then. So don't no, I'm not about to be petty until you be all over a men's league that we ain't getting paid for. Yeah. Nigga, I done lost in high school I games where it really mattered to me. Let's bring, it, nigga, let's, I, let's bring it back. Still my niggas. Let's bring it back. The point is, y'all friendly and y'all No, I'm not saying them. that I'm not friendly. I said that I actually, I can hold a conversation with a motherfucker. I'm sorry. I'm saying I can. Bro. I, I am. Can. I'm that nigga, bro. I can go up and really talk to anybody, bro. I'm, just, oh, bro, I'm, I'm not a friendly ass nigga. Bro. I'm cool. I'm any of my any, any of the chicks that I talk to, they that's the first thing they say. I'm not talking and I don't talk a lot. I think that's the first you don't, thing. But that don't mean you're not friendly. That just means that's, that's exactly, your, bro. If you don't, I, if your if your persona, nigga, everybody that's ever worked with me, people have been around me on a consistent basis. Y'all might think I talk and might be friendly because I'm friendly to people that, that I'm you know. close to. Yeah. Yeah. But bro, if I don't know you, my nigga, we not our conversation ain't gonna last that long. I promise you that. It'll probably be a, a two, three minute conversation. After that, I am silent, my nigga. <laughs> I, 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 Straight up. I but think it's back to what we talk really talked dudes. about. The, but yeah, the really, shit. but the really talk about fame wise, bro, I'm getting a whole new persona, my nigga. Fame with this fame, no bag? Bro, with the, no bag. Oh no, nah, not me, bro. I need the bag. Hey, what's up, Jim? What's going on? How y'all feeling out here? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all see me on that? That's nah. me working, bro. That's me working. So how we gonna yeah, turn the fame into a bag? By easy. keeping it going. Keeping the fame. If you, if, you're, if you recognizable, you can Brand. easily turn it into money. Yeah, somebody else. Instagram, you can just hop on the thing. <laughs> I'll talk some shit for some people. Right, I'm lying like that. I'm definitely, I'm, I'm definitely gonna check. Yeah, we know that. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna be that nigga. I'm gonna be that nigga. How are you planning on changing, man? Bro, I already know. I'm gonna be the nigga. You think that nigga wearing I'm putting everybody chains now. My nigga gonna come in here with one of the motherfuckers. This big nigga around his neck. Nobody talking about that on the jewelry. Big, big chain. No, bro. I, I feel like I'm going to be like a Rick Ross type nigga, bro. I'm just, I'm being here doing a podcast. How I have a little chick that's fan of me or something. Like, bro, bro I'm going to be that nigga, bro. Be doing them With fame, bro, that's bad. Bro, bro I'm that nigga, bro. <laughs> that's how I feel. I'm that nigga. That's how I feel. This nigga going to take his work check and hire a bitch just to Niggas be like, hey, that's flawless. What's good, y'all? Oh, oh, extra God. cool. Hey, boy, it's going to be extra long. Extra cool. Oh, my mom, I think with a bag, I'm going to turn into a hippie. Hippie. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna be on some real zen shit. I don't feel like I have anything to be mad about anymore. Bro, with a bag, I'm <laughs> turning to Xerxes, bro. Oh, this nigga like, have gold bro, earrings I'm and shit. I'm shaking my head bald, bro. I have a statue. <laughs> niggas ask me for bread, bro. You gonna have to kneel before me, bro. You gonna have to kneel before me, bro. <laughs> that nigga, you can see it, bro. That's a problem. Bro. What? <laughs> <laughs> 
peasants. I'm gonna hire some niggas to carry me around, bro. <laughs> that nigga gonna be snapping. Nah, Motherfuckers don't know what it means. Yeah, yeah, that's oh, like, no, that's man. what the bad is. Nah, speaking, gonna... speaking of carrying, man. <laughs> Man, what the fuck is wrong with Dre's ex-wife or future ex-wife, man? Why is she trying to have this man carry her two oh, million yeah. a month? Yeah, she crazy. Uh, how long they been married? Like twenty something years? Oh no, they've been married for a great about fifteen bro. years, man. No, it's been it's, way more I mean, than fifteen. Nigga, like they was married back in like the nineties, the eighties, bro. I thought it was fifteen, but it might be more. No, they got like thirty plus, bro. They've so, been married just as long as uh, what's the name? But two what's million dollars a month? What do you think he worth? How much is he worth? He got a bill. A bill. That's a lot of money. Two million ain't nothing to him then. That's no, that's Man, a lot of money. If okay. you be real to him, two million ain't nothing. I'm going to tell you, oh, like, would it be something to you? Hold on, she want two million a month. A month, yeah, would it be a something month. to you, nigga? That's a lot of money, a nigga. Month. That's right, a lot of money. money. Okay, I'm gonna tell you that's a lot of money. Okay, time out. I don't know the full story. I can <laughs> fill me in. Yeah, bro, but. so allegedly right now she's going through the they going through the pre part of the divorce. They haven't even started the process, the actual divorce. So that's so how right, started off. So right now she wants to compensate for time with her life spending two million a month until they get a decision with the divorce. Oh React. that's it? That's it. Until <laughs> the divorce is final and she get more money in no, that settlement. Don't get nothing. I heard yeah. he got a prenup. He no, do. he didn't. He do. He do got That's a what I heard. He no, got a prenup. Bro, if, if he had a prenup, he wouldn't be going through all this. No, she's fighting that. Yeah, she's fighting for that shit. Yeah, yeah but 100% I heard That's he got a prenup. That's why she's mad, because he do got a prenup. I mean, but I mean, all this that she throwing out Because she came from a basketball player when he got her. She was already with a basketball player. Allegedly, that's what I heard. And I mean, shoot, I guess that's why I got the prenup already. Mm. I'll prenup any bitch. <laughs> Period. You got yeah. prenup. Okay, so she did sign a prenup. She's trying to make her way out of the prenup. Yeah, yeah, see? Right, so, um. I mean, still, I wonder why prenup still. be. I wonder. I wonder why prenup be such a problem. Like, I wonder why people like a man. Why women? Like, like, I, I mean, yeah, women, or I mean, if a chick asks a dude for a prenup, like, why would that be a problem? It's kind of just it's like, like because it's you going making in. sure you're not here for my money. You make sure you're here for me. That's all it's saying. You're If you get upset and mad, it's kind of like, well, are you here for the money? Like, what is you tripping about? Like, the prenup ain't even coming to play if we don't a, get a that's, divorce. And that's mainly because men, that's the way we look at it. Um, as a female point of view, I I would think that they would just, I don't know why the hell they mad, bro. <laughs> no, I mean, at the end of the day, because a nigga, a nigga, like, usually, to be all the way real, if a nigga is breaking up with a female, he usually try and kick her out on her ass on, on in the dirt. I mean, so I get that. So I understand that concept, because, like, if you go into a relationship, especially with they situation, nigga, they got, like, 20, 30 years plus. Yeah. Like, and then she just go out, and then, nigga, do don't get nothing. But, but if I got a billion dollars, I'm going to send you a 10 piece and go on about your business. Get out of my face. I, I just feel like if I have a billion, I could literally just give you like 70. You no, I'm going to give you 10. I can give you 70. I'm going to give you 10. You give, give, you give, you give, you give, give her 10. You give her 10. I mean, give, I don't give 10 minutes of something to my life. I can give you 70. Million. That's what I'm saying. She's been there with him the yeah, whole I time. 70, but I mean, it. even if yeah, your, your spouses yeah, are not on the front for it, they it's helping you. Said than they helping it you. It is, but I still like. They helping you in the back. Yeah, I, I, I would look at if I was a billionaire. I would look at a million like it's a fucking. I'm broke as fuck right now. But a million <laughs> is a million. If I was a billionaire, what's a million to a billionaire? A million fucking dollars. A million dollars, no. nigga. A million still. dollars. Still. It is, but it's still nothing. It's no, it's dollars. something. It's nigga, something. You work for that shit. It's something. It's, it's easier. You're a billionaire. That shit's easier to say, bro. That's why right I said it's right, 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 right now, we could be thou um, we a thousandaires, right? Well, we at least have a thousand dollars somewhere. Yeah. Okay. So what's twenty dollars to a thousand? Nothing. Bro. I can give you Not 20, 20 or 10. Like, no, 20 is something. I sweat off 20, bro. 20 yeah. is nothing, bro. I, I look at 20 for 40 bucks and be like, mm. Less so y'all niggas is just cool when y'all no. break the 20. No, no. get no. 20. Like, just any, this is, okay, this is. Bro, this if, if we're literally, I've got $1,000 and I'm getting divorced, my wife, like, I want a hundred. Here you go. So $100 to my thousand, I'm, I'm what? That's nothing. No, no. It's, that's all that's you it. have. That's pretty much what she's now, doing now. So this you give 
a billionaire, she wants two million. One two. Take your two. A month. A month. Go into the thing is done, and then he gonna stop that. And then I mean, I don't know. It depends on wherever they court thing goes. That's why I want chance that. Do you realize? But that's still this bitch could go for a whole year. But y'all saying like this nigga about to be broke even in a year? That's still not gonna break him, and he still got income coming in. Your position is defending her. You think that is righteous that she get two million? I play devil's advocate. Yes, like she been with him the whole time. Like anything he needed, she been holding him down. What did, what did she do to deserve? I mean, for example, me doing this podcast. My wife got the kids right now. If she didn't, I would have to figure out a way every week to do something with the kids. So she's helping me, even if she's not on the front for of me doing it. If she deserves something, she, if I start getting paid off of this, or her kids also. It is, but that ain't saying she gotta watch them for me when she's I'm doing watching, something. She's watching for her. Those was her kids also. But if I, but it's up. still, if I mean, it's like, what if she got something to do too, and I'm trying to do this? That's where you gotta speak it out and talk. Money is not involved in that. Yeah, that's why that's put the financial but, I mean, so she, I'm just ability. saying, even so, it's bro. It could be anything. Gotta, I could. I could get sick or something and I can't pay the bill and then she'd come and pay the bill that month or something that kept us from being off the street that led to you getting back on your feet to keep it going. That's like if your wife is though. I mean still, but y'all in it as a team. When you marry, okay, you in once, it as a team. So once you're getting a divorce, bitch, the team you deserve quit. Something. We broke up. Yeah, but but I'm saying y'all about, about, about to this, split yeah. up. You deserve something. Not, 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 not two million, million a month. Though. Not two you million. You gotta think, Nick, this is literally Two million dollars a month. Hold on, that's a lot of money. Two million. We're not talking about that, bro. This is real. Hold on, hold on. This is a real lot of money. You're asking for eight hundred thousand dollars in entertainment alone a month. Eight hundred thousand dollars a month. I don't care what she asking for. One hundred fifty thousand dollars in charity to give the money away. I know, I know. I heard that. Is the bitch crazy? It's not gonna put a hole in this nigga pocket at all, bro. Yeah, it would be. Not, bro. bro, nah, fuck that. This listen, money I, now, listen I would be, I would be with y'all if, for example, all this nigga had was a thousand, and she like, nigga, I want three hundred a month, and all I got is a thousand. You're gonna break me, like I'm gonna feel that. He's not gonna feel this. He's a billionaire. He's not gonna feel this, even if it went on for a year, but which you, is not you, gonna go on for no, a year. But you realize, he's not but you realize it. that it's the same thing. If if she said, if you're a thousandaire, and she said, I want twenty dollars a month, it's still for the it's about the tick. Yeah. That shit ticking every time. But that's time. not gonna go on that You long. thinking they off that's the muscle? Long. Then when it start coming out your account. You like damn, damn. Right. Okay. Then what if okay. shit go oh. bad in court? Oh, okay. But time out. He right. still got income coming in too, though. So his money's not gonna drown. If she hit me with twenty dollars and I got a thousand and I still got income coming in, I'm not but gonna But Dre, Dre, ain't, Dre got a soul beats. You know that, right? Yeah, okay. Sold it. It's yeah. gone. So it's a lump sum. He's not getting that. Bro, he still got some income coming. Yeah, but it ain't no beats check. It's not a beats check. He got residuals coming from his yeah, own. Man, man, his that, man, that, man, that, man, man, he's not going to feel that, y'all. I'm sorry. You know, so he knows his problem. Bro, he, he, he obviously do if he's fighting against it. He obviously does if he's fighting against it. What is he getting divorced for? Because that plays a factor, too. He probably He's probably just done. Were they probably just done? You know how I get to. Listen, when I get to a billion dollars. If he dollars, cheated, okay. Now nah, look, look, the, the, the real, the real that's thing what I'm about is to say, this. If she cheated, when nigga, when I can understand <laughs> that thing because your feelings is hurt and junky. You kind of like, you ain't getting nothing from me. You nah, out here well, getting well, smacked. But if well, he well, did it, you got caught. But the real, the leave real you. thing, the real thing is my nigga hit a billion dollars and he probably just felt like, I mean, they probably been having a long, they, they been having a long marriage. So they probably, I mean, the more you gone, the more problematic it is. I could see Dre being gone that entire time, especially the way he was working. I mean, he probably wasn't doing, he probably was in the studio doing other stuff. And then, you know, as you get, you seeing beautiful women all the time. Yeah, I that, that shouldn't affect him no more. Like, uh -huh. That Seeing beautiful women all the time, that, that that shouldn't affect you. You should be a you should be numb to that. I never been there before, so that's know. what I'm saying. To me and yeah, you, <laughs> to me and you, we gonna be like, oh shoot, what's a good looking chick? But but when you're famous, you see them all the time. You got models but around you, you all the time. But you realize, like a lot of majority of men, male celebrities are single the entire time. Diddy is still single. But he was wasn't he about to get married to Cassie or something? Yeah, he was. And he, he fucking with. But he's still, he still he's fucking with. His son and daughter. I mean, son and uh, girlfriend. That's what I'm saying. Wow. He always, he always. So that's what I'm saying. At the end wow. of the day, 
when you got that kind of money, I think it's more easy for you to be a single man opposed to being in a relationship. I see the women throwing themselves at you. I don't know. They throw yourself at you with fame, let alone the bag. You could have a T Pain Pain type of relationship with his wife. They just do threesomes. That's it. He find a bad chick. He'd be like, hey, wifey, I got a chick. I she'd be like, bring her back to the crib. Let's see how she get down. But every woman ain't like that. That's what know? I'm saying. That's why I'm just like, it just that's depends. That's like one out of ten. So I just, that's what I'm just saying to your question. I can't really say it's better to be single than it is in a relationship, even if you're famous. With that money? They got positives I, and negatives. I said I could see it being more beneficial. I didn't say it was like like a definitive that thing. Mm-hmm. I could I could see that being more of a thing because I mean for the simple fact you ain't got no you don't have no ties like you move however you want to move mm-hmm. chicks gonna come over they gonna always come over why because you got money you established they know who you are they know they want to be a part of that so I mean that's that's just that that's gonna hit your pockets more than being in a relationship would so my my take on that man if if she was in that if she was in that that boardroom meeting when he was selling beats by Dre. If she was in that studio when when he was making all these hits, having her input on that. Yeah. If she was doing all of that, okay, give her some bread. I'm pretty Man, sure. Give her some 20, bread. 70, 70 million, fine. Yeah. But, but fine. not no. I'm pretty. If yeah. it's two million, I'm, and I don't know how many years she want two million she has, bro. a month for, how many years or whatever, because it ain't child support. It's alimony. And alimony is some bullshit. If you really want to yeah, talk about it. Uh, and if you already so had the pre no, no, that's not, so, that's so not, that's not bull. Hold on, we can talk about the alimony real quick. I can see that too, because again, when you're in a marriage or something like that, my wife get pregnant, she can't really work like that. I'm doing the work now. I'm paying the bills. I'm making the money, but she's taking care of the kids. So it's a team because I ain't got to worry about the kids. Why I'm going to work and you know, it's a team thing. But so if y'all getting divorced, it's kind of unfair that she was taking care of the kids and now she ain't got no job. She ain't got no income. You about to take it with you and she just stuck. So you, she kind of need alimony to get going. That, that would be going. right, but it don't work like that. Remember Oprah and Stedman, they got divorced. Oprah paid to pay Stedman alimony. I mean, it, I think it's whoever the breadwinner is, ain't it? Yeah, but it don't. So he could have worked. He's a man. He didn't have kids. I mean, man or female that. don't matter. I'm just saying whoever the breadwinner is, once they leave, they're about to take that money with them. And whatever the other person was doing in that same time, they need to be compensated because now you got to He's a doctor. Drive. He's a doctor. A whole I, doctor. Still, I, I, I mean, I, I don't agree with the system. I always, I would, I would say this, and I, I will stand by this, and just to, to, to say in closing, I definitely think. After all this time, a lot of shit needed to be altered. A lot of shit. The marriage, uh, um, oh! Child support. Speaking of that, man, how, how everything go? Did everything go right? Uh, yeah, paperwork got done. So we good, man. Hey! What, what paperwork? Hey. You off child support. Oh, let the people hear you. Say it here. Man, you ain't had to know. Yeah. Well, I ain't been to court yet. <laughs> what? If y'all leave nigga, court, trust that, me, you will see a different nigga in this I'm, like, I'm over here, this nigga like a When I go to court, motherfucker, you're going to see a whole right. new So it ain't final one. The right. paperwork is turned in, though. So all we, right, but yeah, right. court, we're man. in the cross, man. There's, There's still up. time for her to be like, never mind. Yeah, nah. Friends up for my boy. Yeah, don't get the podcast. No, bro, I'm in jail. I'm going to scream with this bitch out something mean. Leave with that, never mind. Oh, okay, all right. I thought it was different. All right, now. I'm <laughs> but, I def- but I definitely think, man, everything need to be altered, man. Things need to be reconsidered just by laws, all this shit, man. We should not be still living by the Constitution verbatim <coughs> when it was written in those time periods. Yeah, yeah. Times have changed. 100 years ago, 500 years ago. Bro, there is no way mm-hmm. that something shouldn't have been altered. Nothing was changed. Yeah. Everything is the exact same. Well, that's what amendments are. They're changes. Alterations. What you mean? Okay, you got you got the Constitution, and then they got something called amendments, which is alterations to the Constitution. Mm. That's what amendments are. That's what they call it. they amending that what the rules are in the Constitution. Oh, okay. So they're breaking those down. But is it, how how often are they changing those? How often, often are those? It has to be a great civil case that it has to make all the way to Washington into the Supreme Court. And then that Supreme Court is when they make amendments. So after, like, you ever, you watch shows or whatever they call it, oh, Roe v. Wade. That's the case that made it all the way to the mm-hmm. Supreme Court. But that's what I'm saying. Like, it's not enough of that in this client, especially in this time period, man. Yeah, it's not. I mean, it just, it, it's a lot of shit that need to be changed. So 
I mean, I wouldn't, just in closing, you cool with the two million a month? Oh, yeah. I'm if not, I'm a billionaire. You cool with it? You cool with it? I don't give a fuck. Yeah, man. Fuck you know. all that two million a month. Take that shit to trial. I'm Mr. Biggs in this bitch. <laughs> For real. Not, you are not Don't be mad if you got caught cheating. I'm just saying. Don't be mad. That nigga's stupid. So I mean <laughs> What y'all what wanna go next, man? Y'all wanna go to Cheaters Greed, man? Cheaters. Have y'all have y'all ever we, suffered we can from do that? that? Hey, one question before we do that. I do wanna get into this. But would y'all do drugs if y'all was rich and famous? Would y'all partake in drugs once? I definitely once, think, yes. I think I would too. And I think it'd be hard shit. That's what I'm saying. I knew y'all was gonna change. I knew y'all was gonna change. Famous. Now, this kind of get into my other topic I want to talk about, which was drugs, which is weed, the, the gateway so-called drug. So we are famous. But I know too many people that, I mean, Snoop Dogg still smoke just weed to this day. Mm -hmm. We don't know what that man do behind closed doors. <laughs> we can't say Wherever that. Wherever he is, he's functioning. Very I mean, good, yeah, I real. mean, so but, but we know matter. it's kind of like one of those we things that you know a lot of celebrities do coke. But you don't know who doing it. The but you do, know. You say it all, all you can I mean, unless you say it. You bro, I just recently learned this week that Coke is the high is way better than weed. Yeah. This is what I was told. Yeah. I ain't never tried it. But they was like, bro, Coke is way better than well, weed. Look, I mean, like circumstances. And then, I you can, and, then, and then you can get, if you want to go even higher than that, you do her heroin and meth. Yeah, that's <laughs> Right there. I, ain't, I ain't injecting shit in my body. But, but I mean, so us on the that. podcast, so far, how many drugs have y'all taken so far? And uh, what was it? Weed and ecstasy. I wanted to try an ex. Nigga. I they wanted, made ecstasy sound too late. That's the only reason you why. You know. Ecstasy. Listen, nigga. Listen, nigga. Listen, that shit's something different, bro. Yeah. I told you about the time I tried it. What it, what it, what it, what it told me. My experience is what happens. My dick can't get hard at all, bro. I thought that's what it was to make you do. I can't get sleep. Nah, bro. Speed bass. Speed. Yeah, I guess it's different bases. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was it, bro. I was up. I was feeling good. But, bro, that was working. <laughs> I, everything working. was working. So for you, you was in. I was feeling good. I was wired though, mad wired, whole day up, focused. Yeah, you up, focused. You up. How long eggs uh, last? Uh, about, about a day. day and a half. Yeah, about right. a day. Damn. Yeah, <laughs> but, but it's not a bad feeling the whole time until the down. Once the down kick in, you like, oh bro, shit. I was ready to go sleep. Yeah, right. bro. It's like, all right, <laughs> I'm done, nigga. All right, like, please stop. <laughs> like, please oh, stop. Damn. But the high. Oh my God, bro! You just gonna want so to is the X better than weed? You know, for the for the high. High. No, it was too much. Nah, for me. It was too nah. much for me. Weed is a chill. How the high is great on weed. Weed is relaxing. Ecstasy is you, 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 you you're focused. Like every, you feel like you can do whatever. Yeah. I can do whatever do the fuck think, I want to do. Why do y'all think weed gets in the way of some of my stuff and X and coke and stuff don't get in the way? For example, I it be niggas that will not take a job. Because they smoke weed, they're lit. Like weed is so powerful to some people, they be like, "I gotta smoke three times a day, or I can't function." Yeah, that's weird. Like I'm just like I don't understand I would, that. I would say this because oh, is weed is legally is is literally demonized everywhere, yeah, but it's legal lot. in what like Canada. twenty states. Yeah. It's legal in Canada. In Canada no, too. A lot of like, like, like almost yeah. thirty oh, Chicago. Chicago, shit, they got yeah. Chicago, Chicago you know California, Colorado. Colorado stuff I don't do. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> but it's legal in a lot of states. It's legal in most states, but just not Man, federally. Countries. So it's for it to be legal and it, it's just uh what's it what's the word? Hypocritical? Yeah. It's hypocritical that it's legal in a lot of states, but it's not in some states. Yeah. And I think it's one of those things that's forward. coming like a little at a time. We're I think it's to the point that so many people just doing weed and they just keep seeing these cases come in. Oh, he got caught weed, got caught weed. It's just getting annoying. They just like, look, we might as well just legal. Dude, yeah, yeah, it's yeah. like, why, why give a nigga 2010 or anything for some weed? Bro, like, what yeah. the fuck? I mean, wait, but, but wait. back to the original question, which is, what drugs would I do? <sighs> He was waiting to get yeah, his in there. Yeah, bro. <laughs> I want to get, I want to go take my picks. I definitely want to do shrooms. Yeah. I'm with it. I definitely want to. What that is. They said, not, not shrooms. Uh, so the, the peel? Mushrooms. 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 You cook it? No. Huh. It's mushrooms. mushrooms. And you just eat it? It's yeah. a hallucination. Yep, you just eat it. They dry it. But your body, but your body's supposed to react to it naturally. Yeah. But definitely, I definitely would do shrooms. Definitely might. It depends. I, I probably wouldn't do cocaine. I would. 
I probably wouldn't. I'm gonna I'm a say probably. This nigga. I probably wouldn't, but I don't know. But we, I we definitely. Coke. I would keep cocaine for the hoes. That's what I'm saying, bro. bro. I wouldn't do it. Just a line for these bitches. I'm gonna just one line and I'm gonna let these bitches go at it. I'm gonna get these bitches nasty, bro. They love it. It's gonna be pussy they and ass and water and shit everywhere. I do it a lot they of party they girls. Turn them a lot bro. of party girls be like, you got some coke? I'm like, nah, they're like, ah. I'm about to call so and so. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna fill the whole hotel with. Foam and balloons is, and cameras, yeah, yeah. neon lights. That's a, yeah, that's I just want a night like that, bro. At, at least, at least rooms, weed, and some probably some pills, maybe cocaine. I'm doing cocaine. So I got three in the possible. Maybe cocaine. So what's holding y'all back from just doing it now? Uh, for what? I no, work. No purpose. <laughs> I work. I don't see the purpose. Yeah. In there. It ain't gonna be I, no purpose when you get fed. Yeah, I'm gonna have helly bitches. Who gonna drug test you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I am. Who gonna drug test you? You know what I mean? Gonna, to me, it's gonna be more celebratory things. Like I mean, I would have a. Like I'm not gonna just be in the co in the crib just doing drugs. No, it's gonna be it's gonna bitches. be celebratory. Yeah. Like it's gonna be a lot Hell of people bitches. around. I mean, that's what I'm saying. Time. We can do that now. No, oh. it ain't no bitches. Look, Look, I need mean, celebrities. You might as well see Money, money. strippers. But do you know the difference? We can a fucking horse. We can do that now. <laughs> horse we, in this we could do that now, can't but financially it probably wouldn't be, be that. Yeah, big. you would take a hit. Yeah, oh, like if we were to party the way the way I am. Exactly, boy. I want a fucking horse. <laughs> I don't know why this horse in this motherfucker, but it's a horse in this motherfucker. And midgets. That's when you know you partying hard, bro. When it's a room full of midgets. It's just random shit in there. It's just shit. I just want to be that nigga. And I don't remember none of that shit when I wake I lost a finger. All kinds of shit going on. Yeah, bro. I want to get fucked up. Yeah, I want to get fucked up, bro. Yeah, I want some shit like that. What about you, girls? Uh, nah, I'll be down for a lot of that shit. Uh, like you said, mushrooms. I want to try DMT. Yeah, what is that? Whole experience. I don't want to do that. I want what is that? DMT. I'm so lost. It's uh We got that shit in our body. Look, yeah, it's the shit that's in your body. It's releases when you die. Yeah. So it's most the most it's the most powerful hallucinogen. Mm -hmm. They say it's pretty much you see God when you do it. Yeah. Everybody, people that did it, they say they see God so or see like different stuff. A lot, a lot of people do DMT and they say it's the closest and and, and people that take it through through the ages, through centuries, they done took it. Yeah. yeah, and it shouldn't yeah. be illegal. Look out, who got big, my nigga eyes. <laughs> I'm over here learning something. And new. It's, if you take it, they'll never know it's in your system. They say it's the most spiritual. It's it's so why don't y'all just do that? Cause nigga, for one, that shit hard to do, and you gotta talk to like you a man. gotta find it's somebody. Hard, it's hard. illegal. Yeah, it's and, hard it's, and it's hard to find. It's yeah. hard to find, and it's, it's, it's you it's really illegal. gotta have a motherfucker perform that. It wasn't illegal to motherfuckers start doing it. Who like that? Yup, that's Hollywood. He said performing. But he said yeah, everything. Nigga, got, they got lay you out for that shit. They said that nigga, you can't move when you take yeah. that shit. Like, so it's two. They say you, it's a. There's supposed to be barriers to that. So you take the first hits, first barrier, second hit, second barrier, third hit. You guys only supposed to take three hits of that shit. Mm -hmm. But after you do it, you lay down for like 20, 30 minutes supposedly. Yeah. But it feel but like it, an eternity. But it feel like eternity. Yeah, bro. It feel like. Years. You did it before? No, that shit just sounds great. It up. sound great though, you hear it, bro. <laughs> but that's just some powerful but they, shit. But they come out of it saying they know a lot of shit. They just seen this, the, they done heard this, they the done Mayans, did this. Nigga, they see the Mayans. The, the, bro, from the Mayans to any ancient civilization nah, that nah, you nah, ever nah. heard of, bro. Nah, that's they that's did, good stuff. They didn't talk about their kids. <laughs> yeah, that's some shit I can't. Boy, if I ever got talked to a drug, it happened just now. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, one. <laughs> yeah, yeah that'd be the one. That's bro, crazy, you go on this, they say, nigga, you go on a spiritual journey. Yeah, literally. It's a spiritual journey. They say the life about 15 They call it the God particle, bro, the God molecule. I'm with that. Let me see something different. My name is Mike Tyson, said took that shit and woke up a whole new nigga. A whole like yeah, I mean, bro. people take that different. and really change their whole life. Yeah, they, just, they just humble themselves, bro. Boy, I'm with that. DMT just become yeah. the superest, humblest nigga. If it could change my anger, I would definitely take that. Yeah, shit. you need to get that out, bro. Yeah, if that they say you really go to journal. It's only like 20, 30 minutes. You stuck, bro, but you there for the journey. Yeah. So you down okay. with the DMT? Yeah, when I get famous, I'm gonna do that on the low. Y'all ain't gonna know what's happening, <laughs> but Duh. I'm gonna come on the podcast like. Oh, <laughs> that nigga there. No, oh, this what? is all childish. It doesn't matter in the end. Get <laughs> <laughs> the fuck out of here with that shit. I'm gonna be like, what the Let's fuck? Let's just talk about the most high. <laughs> the most high. Me. Yeah. Right. Hey. Me. I'm Y'all gonna know when it happens. That'd probably that'd be it. Yeah. yeah. That'd definitely be it. And uh, what's crazy but, about DMT, a lot of people report the same trips. 
They report yeah, they say, yeah, they say it's the same thing. I'm I'm a, I'm gonna investigate. I got Google at the palm of my hand. I'm about to get into that. Yep. DMT? DMT. DMT. Or the toad. <laughs> Do the toad. No, no, I ain't right. licking no toad. No, 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 you don't lick no toad. You don't lick it. No, I'm not literally licking the toad. Shit. Yeah. They scrape that. Man. Look, one drug at a time. They scrape it. Like, one at a time. So you got him at one. The spiritual, and I'll take that. The toad would have But back, back to my nigga Cheater's Greed. Explain this to the people what you mean. Cheater's Greed, man. So Cheater's Greed basically is like most of the time when niggas cheat, they get away with it the first time. But for whatever reason, for whatever reason, niggas just get greedy, bro. They either keep doing it or they try and find a new chick to cheat with that really want more of your time. Yeah. So that's really what cheater greed is. Like you literally get greedy. You got a good girl at the crib. You probably, you, I mean, most niggas, we, we'd have had this conversation on the podcast plenty of times where niggas just really want to get one off with something new, something fresh. But niggas just get greedy. Mm -hmm. Can we all... All at once, together, say we've suffered from cheaters. <laughs> I can't say that. Oh, you haven't? Mm -mm, I'll be out of there. I'll be out of there. You a one-time offender? Mm -hmm. I, I'm, yeah. You ain't never got caught cheating? No. Oh, you you the nigga. No, no. Oh, you the nigga. nigga. Roger, how to be a player? Train your times. No, 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 no. I don't. I don't keep going back. Yeah, that's see, now that's the difference. That's, that's the. That, I, and that's, I, I, I so, literally hit it and just be like, I'm cool because I know I I always pin out my whole situation. If I go over there again, I, all right, I'm gonna have to figure out another lot. And I'm lazy when it comes to lying. Yeah. I don't want to constantly keep lying. That's, that's good. So, so we got like, uh, oh, what's well, so up? We really can have a dialogue about this conversation then. Yeah. Because we got one that that's, that haven't done it. I know I've definitely been greedy. Yeah, I got caught. Yeah, being greedy. Yeah. I I done been greedy, bro. Like yeah. if you get, because I mean, and I I basically put it in the same thing as robbing a bank. If you rob it once and you get away with it, I'm gonna try it again. No, nah, you you shouldn't. Yeah, yeah you got the you, you got the bag. <laughs> you straight, but nigga, like, shit, well, I did it once. I can it, do it again. Is it, is it a trigger for y'all to make y'all go cheat? What you mean? That to make you cheat to keep going back? Is it a trigger? Like some of your girl do, you be like, all right, I'm going. It to don't be what thing. she do. It's what the other bitch do. Yeah, that's really what it be for me. Yeah, it don't be. It don't. Well, like the, the other chick, side chick, trash or something. Good. No, what like you something no. that your girl do that that'll trigger you. Like something that okay, I'm about to go mess with old girl again. Nah, I've nah, never yeah, that. mine don't ever be because of the chick. Well, to a point, no. to a point, it depends. Like now, this you got to get in detail with because if you got years in with your chick, it could be some. She just stressed me out to the point where it's like I just need to go or and that's ain't the word no I was looking for is stress. This for me is anger. Every time we argue. I don't have to argue with this other girl. This other girl gonna let me come over here, smash, yeah. feed me, do whatever the fuck she gonna yeah. do, and I'm gonna come back home like nothing. It's all good. Better. Better than ever. Yeah. So the trigger word for me is stress. Uh, that that That's what triggers triggers me for me. That's the only way I'll come back. <clears throat> Mission? I think... I, I that's think That's my greed. <laughs> <laughs> that's what you're talking about. <laughs> my greed wouldn't... My, my greed would be multiple chicks it wouldn't be going back to the same one mm -hmm. it's just knowing it's just having too many i feel like niggas don't know when to stop and they overload themselves you get like one good chick then you want to get two then you got like four side chicks that's when it get uh, ugly yeah. but see that, but that but that's what i'm saying like you get that to me it's really been the uh the whole thing of uh Oh, man, like some chicks, I, I've never, what, what Kel said, I've never cheated because I was mad or something like that. Most of the time, if I do it, it's probably just on some, let me see if I got it. But then I don't leave the situation. Like I, sometimes I just be like, let me see if I still got it, if I can make this happen. Yeah. Make it happen and then I'd be like, Shoot. She, then she she hit me with an offer like, hey, I'm cooking. And she might be cooking something better than what I'm eating at the crib. So I might just be like, you know what? That does sound better. <laughs> that door will be open after that. Yeah. So that's that's usually what I suffer from, man. Usually. Do y'all feel like it's a biological need to smack other women? It nah, is. Not for me. Not for I you. mean, well, it's built in the man, like, DNA that we're supposed to multiply. For, yeah, I feel that hard and strong. Like, maybe not as strong as it was when I was in my teenagers and 20s. But still, to this day, I could be with a woman, and do you think it? Do you think it is? So, do you think you could be perfectly happy with a woman, 
and still want to smack something different. Yes. You think so? You can be perfectly happy. She can do everything right. What about you? You think that? Yeah, I ain't think so either. I don't, think, don't so think so. Either. No, I, don't I feel so. like if I'm perfectly happy, like if I'm talking about like everything is good, like the our financial, sex, traveling. All that, all worry. that mean. I, I think all that mean is you're never going to leave her. That's what that means. That's what that means. But your eyeballs and your attraction and and lust is not turned off. That's that's the psychological and evolutionary need that your body tells you. Your body tell you your dick get hard from looking at another female. You like. You don't. You, that's not you. You you consciously not thinking about it, but your body is like she got some motherfucking ass on her, or she got some hips on her. Or I would love to smack that. <laughs> like that, you don't. It, it got a lot that. to do with your mind frame too, because I mean, when you're in the right mind space, it wouldn't even get that say. far. It wouldn't get that say, far. I, I don't think. Like if you literally are focused on what y'all trying to accomplish, like I mean, you ain't gonna be thinking that. Like. There's some, there's some you shit gonna that be like, catch your attention, bro. I, you, I, you look it's at definitely it. shit that just catch your it, attention. It, it, yeah, that's true. It could be some random that, oh, snap, drop some apples, and you try to be nice, help her up, and you look at her like, ooh. Like, I mean, it could be anything that just catch your attention. So, I mean, that's true, but... But, I mean, it, it take a lot of thought. It's more of a... It's more of a uh, but again... It's more, to me, it's more of a mental thing to actually encounter with a, a person. A, a woman once told me, because I was bringing it up, like, I was telling her that a man has a psychological need to smack as many chicks as he want. That's what your body tells you to do. Since you're a teenager, every man has that problem that their body tells them to smack as many females as you possibly can. And... It, I'm like, we can't control it how our body works. And she literally sat there and told <laughs> that nigga me. said, I can't control No, bro, you put yourself in that situation. And she literally sat there and told me. Everybody. She literally sat there and told me, so men can't control themselves. And it made me sound so stupid. And I was like, huh, I guess you're right. <laughs> <laughs> I guess you're right. Yeah, yeah you saying. always got choice, man. You always got no, choice. you definitely got choice, but. The body gonna do what the body wants. Yeah, and then, and then what, I mean, like my nigga Milton said already, it's just, I, it was really. I think it's not, I ain't gonna say it's not possible, but it's very unlikely yeah, it's possible, you're gonna bro. find um, the most like perfect chick or perfect relationship. Yeah, that just it's, it's more than possible. No, it's not more than possible. It's very unlikely to happen. It's more than possible. Bro. No, it's not, bro. You're not about to find no perfect chick, bro. For that you, don't exist. You find a perfect chick for you. I don't know why that you don't keep exist. That, How you bro? can't say? How because because y'all still gonna argue and fight, bro. Like, That's a part of a relationship, but that exactly. doesn't mean she's not perfect for you, bro. Yeah, yeah, dude. You should be arguing if y'all if, if she's yes, perfect for no. you. You don't if argue you, with a bitch or nothing. That shit's boring. So. That that's taking away the So you want to be toxic? That's not just to toxic. That's just to argue. I, I, I'll be telling you. I'm just time. saying that. I mean, I feel like arguing. I feel like arguing is normal. But that's just that that leads to other problems in the long run. Like, that, that, like stress. Like I'm saying, I don't feel like arguing with you right now. And but let that's me. A and if we thing, keep arguing, moment. it could get to the point where I mean, you might want to flip out. I mean, you might. Break some, break her or something. I mean, you never know. Like, but bro, bro you, no, that you, we're not talking. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. You never know. Some bro, niggas got a temper on, like that. Wait a minute. I don't know what you're talking about. You can have an argument, a civil argument, and y'all can both come to a conclusion you, and move forward. That don't. Don't, that, that that don't happen a lot. You, but it happens. It happens. I just said it don't happen a lot. Well, that's but what we're saying. Happen. We saying uh, you can you can find the perfect person yeah. for you. Y'all don't, don't happen happens. all the time, but and it happens. It's harder than what it's if it was that easy, motherfucker. And that's that's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, How many niggas right y'all know that got but a perfect girl for them? How I mean, many you niggas really ask niggas it's, that you don't ask them. Okay, even if you see them do together, you how, how would you, you know what's okay, going on outside? Let's, let's of ask a nigga. Do you got the perfect girl for you? And then for me, yes. You can't say that this nigga been with this chick for like a year. Do you have the perfect girl for you? No, I'm not. She's not the perfect one for me. I'm damn. being honest. She's not the perfect one for me. We good. Damn. We good. Okay. <laughs> That's how we've been together. Maybe we should switch subjects, bro. Oh, no. It's a lot too hard, yeah, bro. No, 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 clean no, that shit no, the fuck no, up. No, I'm going to be all the way bro, real. Bro, damn. I don't think that exists, bro. Damn. That's just me. That just That's not tough, exist. That's tough, bro. That don't exist, That's man. Tough as fuck. That don't exist. <laughs> bro, There's no such thing as perfect, bro. What? Sorry. It's not. <laughs> what the fuck, bro? That came out too good. Like you being because I'm, I'm being real with y'all. I'm not about to be fake. 
Bro, bro I'm not what no the perfect. Fuck? I'm not no, bro. I don't think there is one. Not even knocking her. Yes, it is, even bro. next shit I get with, bro, yes, I feel like it it's is. gonna be the same I, thing with a different chick. I, 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 I definitely think he's right. I don't think there's never a perfect one for you or perfect at period. It's not. I bro. can love a chick so fucking hard and still be like, damn, she's horrible for me. Horrible. What are y'all talking about? I'm not bro, understanding what y'all talking about. about. I don't I'm not understanding bro. Bro. You can find a chick this, that you want to be this, with. This, and what are y'all talking about? Okay. What are y'all trying to say? What are y'all trying to say? Yeah. This is the most mind boggling conversation every time what, we what get What are y'all trying to say, man? How do you not? Like, I'm. what I'm asking, what we're saying is that there is a woman out there that is so perfect for this particular person no matter what they no matter the argument break the, it down i'm trying to no 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 what you're saying is like a disease it's a lot of diseases i need you to get into it for me and break it down you talk about it's a perfect chick for a perfect nigga what not a perfect, perfect chick for him she what? fits everything that he's requiring right, right. like, so, like so whatever look, he wants she's for, that for example for example if you have a problem with arguing all the time, she will bring it to a minimum where it's a balance. Yeah, in fact, it's okay. not, it's not, it's not, it's not a, it's not a whole thing of no, you're not gonna not argue. That's not the, mm. that's not what we're saying. But it, it's gonna, she's going to make it to where she, she understands you as a person. She's going to always compensate for you, and and, and it's not a, like something that she's trying to do. It's something that's built in her. It's not like. Yeah. A, it's not like oh she's just her. Yeah, like it's it's a it's a perfect thing for you. Whatever it is. Okay. So it's not it's not not whether it's That's argument, whether it's sex, whether it's whatever it is, she's going to she's gonna please you to a point to where you are more than satisfied and it's a it's a perfect situation for you. No, I'm I'm y'all grow, y'all This grow. is this is what you're saying. Y'all gotta stop using the word perfect. I think this is where we're messing up at. There's no such thing as perfect. We need to stop saying There's that. There's no such thing as a perfect person. Okay, for let you, me say this. Let, for me, a particular let me say person. this. That, stop using the word perfect. What you talking about right now is basically just what you can deal with. Your no, dealing level, because like you just said, it, yes it is. If you can deal with one chick always smoking, or you can't, so you get with another chick that don't smoke, but she just drink. You can deal with that, and what y'all saying but is she's still perfect not perfect for perfect. him. But 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 that's what y'all saying though, because she wasn't perfect because she smoked. He don't leave her and get with the chick that just drink, and he cool with that because he drink. So that's a perfect person for him. So a person that's that, what y'all saying. What I'm saying is You're a person that can come us. in and literally, I, I say a perfect person for uh, for a situation like me is somebody who can be <laughs> the opposite of what I am, which is angry. Uh, like living all the time. If somebody can if, be different than that, then that's the, perfect if you're for the me. Opposite, and that's what you going consider to, perfect. Yes, and that's my consideration. Okay, and you no, always bro. know what's best for you. And you always exactly. know what's you best for you. Exactly. You always know what's best for you. The person, listen. The I person. Don't the per so. well, you don't know, say, always know what's best well, for you. you can be shit you, that you don't even determine as good for you that can pop up in your life. Like I didn't know I needed this. That's true. But. If somebody, if that's what I'm saying. Somebody opposite of you is gonna show you all the stuff you didn't know you needed. Y'all gonna clash because if they're doing the opposite thing to you, that's gonna make you mad. Like, so if I'm mad and she's you mad, that, you think I'm about to be happy clash. with her being mad too? Yeah, that's but what hold we on, say. wait a minute, wait a minute, wait but, a minute. So this is what I'm saying. A person, a person opposite of you should transcend your thinking. Your yes. thinking is one track. Okay. If, if I'm one always, if, I, if I'm, if I'm always angry. And she shows me a enlightened side, and she handles it a different way. And I'll be like, "Damn, oh, I like that." Yeah, that's, a, that's that, transcending that, your, that, thought, that your thought process. That could happen. So the, hold on, what we're speaking on is this: when we say perfect for you, the person is yin to your yang. Exactly. So whatever it is that makes you out of balance, coalesce. She balances now. that out. I'm telling you. That's that's what that, that means. Exist. Perfect. For you. So nobody can ever balance you out. That's what he just said. Do nobody you know can. somebody that got balanced out? I don't. I don't know nobody that well, got okay, balanced out. Nobody that's got balanced out. Y'all talking about balance? Not one person is black or white. Everybody is different and, and complicated. Facts. Everybody has facts. Thing. So you talking about yin and yang and black and white? It's not none of that. People are complicated, bro. It's not. But no they complication. Listen, to you. hold on, hold on. So, so this is what I'm saying. You have a daughter, right? Right. Say if you meet a chick. And she gets along with your daughter. She helps you uh, food prepping, whatever, helping you eat better. She's helping you progress in life. Showing you how to get the bag. She, she, she's talking to y'all, have in-depth conversations. 
but y'all y'all growing all this all these good things all these positive things and she beautiful. when you get mad she knows how to talk to you where you not is the uh, the uh, the argument Instead ain't going of crazy. Antagonizing you. What's happening right now? Okay, you're building a chick that don't exist. How right, don't women like that, that don't exist? There there is every no woman chick is okay. perfect like that, bro. Okay, from what, ain't no chick perfect like that. You, 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 you're talking about this chick is doing everything this nigga need, bro. Ain't no chick out there like that. Bro. How do you know that? How do you I, know I that? I don't know nobody that got a chick like that. that. Nick, you just don't okay, know. Okay, but you're saying the same thing I'm saying because you don't know nobody then, that do then, that. At that point, then it's still in the air. Bro. Okay, so stop, it, so stop saying there's a perfect chick out there if you don't know that then. The same way I'm saying it's bro, not. Bro, don't make sense, Nick. That don't make sense, bro. stop saying it is you're arguing you against yourself, know. bro. No, y'all doing the same thing. We're, we're not because we're saying that it's a possibility. I'm saying it's not a possibility. Exactly. So, so you're arguing no, we, against we yourself. We don't know. We don't know. We can't what say that. Are you That's what I'm saying. Don't feel nobody up. No, they, they they hands up or spirits up with something you don't even know. You don't know one person Bro, in I, real life. You know what's that's, funny? That's you know like, what's, yes, that's, I, 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 I do know people in real life, in real life, that say they have their best friend. They, 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 they are completely and utterly happy. How, but my, how listen, long I know. My uncle and my uncle and auntie have been together for over shit. I'm 34. How old? How before old are they? I was 34. How old are they? They in their 50s. They like 55. Okay. Now we need to now we need to get to, to a different level. When you 50, 60 something, bro, you're not about to be out there clowning or arguing or doing all that. You're even old when now. You're young. mature. When you younger, they would, bro. Oh, hold on. This hold on. You didn't even let me. You happen, didn't. You bro. didn't even let me finish. Because you just they were together. Hold on. Wait okay, a minute. Ahead, they were. They have been together. Literally. From twenty, from twenty to fifty something. That's over thirty plus years. They okay. are still perfectly happy, smiling, with, with posting each other all always out to eat. Perfect, perfect, perfect for each other. Of course, they have they they, they problems within the relationship. Cool, mm -hmm. that's normal in a relationship. Yeah, facts. But they but they <laughs> they balance each other out. They perfect for each other. Okay, this is what I'm gonna what say. What do you not get? Is there such a thing as settling? If you've been with this person for How's so long, that's exactly what I'm about to say. Well, if you've been okay. with this person for so long, now, now it sounds like be, y'all trying to y'all trying to reach this. Exactly no, because yeah, now y'all trying to pick real, the flaw. Settling, 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 settling is not real. An example. Settling is not real. Settling is a real thing, but that don't mean every situation that's perfect is you settling. Bro, there's no such thing as perfect. Stop saying that, bro. I been Listen, you gotta understand. Years, if somebody's bro. perfect to you, then they're perfect to you. Bro, nobody can. If somebody is perfect you can, to me, you, can, you, you can, can't change you my can, mind about okay. it. No matter okay. what the fuck okay. you say, you can say I'm that. There. You can say that. You and can that's say what it okay. is to but, me, okay. to you. Right. But, that's what but, they're talking but about. around you, if you're the common denominator, saying she's perfect, everybody else saying, bro, she's really not. She's not, bro. She's for like, me. You, you give you're, a you're, you're back to what Kale said. Thing, girl? You back to what Kale said is you settling. That's it. What am I settling okay. for if I want if, it? If you at a certain age, bro, that makes no the, sense to me, man. Yeah. Relationship for fifteen years, but at that year know. sixteen, shit go wrong, bro. You like, damn, I've been with this motherfucker for fifteen years. What so one bad think? experience is gonna make me say, damn, I've been with this motherfucker for fifteen years. But at, yeah, at the same time, the next fifteen years, now y'all together thirty years. The last fifteen years been horrible. I don't know. Are, are, at, at, at 30 years, are you going to divorce you gonna go through, Bro, you're going to well, go through That's what I'm loves. saying. You're definitely, that's what I'm if saying. If it's 15 years, going to listen, go through mad if it's 15 problems, years no of negativity, chick you get listen, with. though, if it's 15 years of negativity, then I'm probably going to ex exit myself. But that's I, just what it is. How old are you at this point? Who and knows? Hold on. Who fucking knows? You can hang out throwing out. Hold on, hold on. And then y'all are throwing out. Outrageous numbers. numbers, bro. Outrageous I'm numbers. About. Bro, nobody is going to sit and in a for bag 16 years. for 15 huh. years. There's no way. Y'all surprised. Yeah. yeah. Come yeah, on, man. Act like y'all don't know. Come on, man. Y'all act like y'all don't know how life really works. Listen, but come on, man. That's a, Hold that's on. A, hold that's on. A, that's a, no, 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 that's a, no one ain't. No one ain't. No one ain't. Let me let me say something real quick. Go ahead. Get with you because I'm going to Just because y'all going through hard times and stuff and you like you should just leave, it ain't that easy sometimes. 15 years? It don't matter, bro. It could be 12 years. You got kids. Yeah, with this yeah, person, it could be anything that just got you tied in listen, here, though. where you can't, right. you, you're not trying to leave. Listen, okay, cool. Give me a reason. Right, cool. No, give me a reason 
why you would stay. Even if, listen, give me a valid reason. Your kids. Why no people? Okay, I'll stop. So you're gonna depress yourself and do all this. Listen though. Yeah. For 15 years, Bro, just because you have children. children. People, people do kill themselves. People kill themselves. Yeah, but just because of something. Then they're exiting the situation listen, no matter I'm, what. I'm, I'm, I'm That's a still exiting this I'm, 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 I'm off myself. I'm gone. Listen. Listen, I'm gonna speak on myself. I can, I can only, I can only speak what, on me. That's so, but this is what, this, what this is what, right? So uh, what even, saying. even talking about further. everybody. But, but, nigga, you but bring in everybody. We keep saying what the fuck is you? Because I bring in everybody. But I'm bringing in everybody. Y'all started it. That's what we're saying. Y'all like, hey, there's a perfect chick I refer to. I'm like, oh, pause. Uh, no, you can't say that. But that's for you. No, you can't say that. It's, it's really what you willing to deal with. It's really that's all it is, bro. bro. It's not, not going to be listen, perfect. You're going to have, you're gonna have to deal with some bull crap no matter who you get it with, bro. Is what you, you know, no, I'm agreeing with Nick because you definitely going to have to deal with some, some bullshit with everybody you deal with. We not... Bro, so, never mind. So it's not bro. perfect. Y'all Stop saying perfect. Bro, y'all don't get it, bro. It's, it's one of those that's going... Right over there. <laughs> like, it's bro. one of those, bro. We can... Uh, so, listen. The ball is over there. Yeah, 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 bro. It's over y'all head. Yeah, not trying to let y'all get it. Y'all in denial. And, 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 and some here, for some and some, reason, at one point, y'all gonna take a sip and be like, no, that's what they were talking about. It's really how much bullshit you willing to put up with if you love this person enough to put up with that bullshit. So you think that's the only thing that keeps relationships together? That's not the only thing I just said. It could be kids. It could be in a job situation. It could be no family around. It could be anything that'll keep you there. That's the reason why they're saying make it make sense because math is equation. If if the kids and this shit and this shit, nigga, if you want to put up listen, with all this shit, bro. Listen, my nigga. So I'm you telling me y'all 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 think that people are really willing to suffer? People are like that. To suffer, people yes. are, bro. But, yes. people okay, so are, do you they think they it's are. a majority? I don't know that. Okay, I don't know that. Do chicks stay in hey, people. Okay, my opinion. opinion. My opinion. Chicks stay in abusive relationships. Why don't they just leave? We're not asking you. No, we it's the same thing. Specific. It's the same thing. People stay specific. in relationships for the dumbest reasons. Right, we but that's what I stated earlier. You just did, but you just said no, it's not, bro. When what I said it, I said that's stupidity. You said it's not that. It, did he not what say that? He said it's not that. So people suffer for they want to suffer. Now then it's stupid. Their... That's what I'm saying. It's it stupidity. Be, it be stupid, but what is the point here? I'm missing the point. Bro, you You're are saying, doing the same was, thing again. I'm telling you everything is not perfect. What is I'm the not saying is? everything is perfect. What I'm saying is, listen, listen to when I say it out my mouth, please, before you cut me off. Perfect for you. For you. <laughs> okay. I don't know. It's the perfect easiest Perfect for thing. you. Yeah, for you. And they stand in a dumb relationship because they're getting abused, but it's still perfect for her. But we all know it's Then dumb. that person is perfect for them. So it's not perfect. How if it's perfect for them? If they're saying or stating Be that it's perfect okay. for them, then okay, it's not hold on, hold on, talk about real quick. You can't change their mind on that. Listen to me. Just because you can't change somebody's mind don't mean that's right. But that's from the outside looking in. Hold on, time out. If a nigga go kill somebody because they killed his brother, do you think he's in but the way? But that's not dating. But, I'm not talking no, about no, 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 no. Let's talk about the what mind. The fuck? Let's talk about the <laughs> mind. Let's talk about the mind real quick. If in their mind they think this person's perfect and we see it's not... Do that make it perfect? For them! It's not perfect. Yes, it though. does for them! But they're wrong, bro, right? You are that, that's their opinion. But 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 bro, they're that's wrong. That's my right? opinion against right. their but, opinion. But they're wrong. That I don't have no I don't have no no approval of bro. what the fuck you are. If you oh right, you God. right, nigga. No, that's it's not, your girl. Bro. No, it's that's not. your love. If you say the broad, if you say if you say the sky is green and it's blue, I'm gonna say that's not right. And you're gonna be like, and you're gonna be like, and you're gonna be like, and you're gonna Bro, Yo, eyes are different than mine, bro. Then, bro. Now you just argue That's your and opinion, argue, bro. You bro, just argue You cannot argue. change bro. nobody's opinion, you just, bro. Okay. On who you they ain't love. Gonna, you ain't or gonna, what's perfect listen, for them. Right. You don't have to change that opinion. It don't mean it's right. That's what I'm what? saying. Bro, for Everybody them, got an though, opinion. It's oh, not right for people's us. Opinions be people's opinions hey. be wrong. People's opinions be wrong. Bro, Hitler all right, beat this out. Beat this out. Beat this out. No, beat this out. All right, come this out. We ain't going to get on Hitler because Hitler <laughs> wasn't wrong. Beat this out. So, what you mean he wasn't wrong? I'll, I'll tell you that later. We'll talk about that in another episode. So, to, so if say say we go out. You with your <laughs> female, right? Boom. This nigga like, hey, babe, uh, make sure you grab it. And y'all looking at him like, damn, he demanding. Like, that's damn near, like, you ain't controlling nothing. But y'all don't know at home, this nigga gets her everything she wants, loves on her as much as she wants, rubs her feet when she gets off work, treats her like a fucking queen. But all you seen was that one moment 
of him somewhat raising his voice or being being masculine towards her. Mm -hmm. But you like, damn, that nigga might not be the one for you. I don't, I'm not used to seeing niggas talk to you like that. So is he not perfect? Is that not perfect for her? Now we're going to be grown about the situation. <laughs> what you just said ain't big enough to leave a relationship. That's not... But that's what, so if you, what if you know that's not what they used to? They used to niggas just... Just be, being uh, whips to them. And this one nigga, it's like, nah, fuck that. Like, I'm going to be the man. You you not about to run that shit on me. And you like, girl, that ain't what he used to. That ain't what you used to. He ain't right for you. You, you don't, don't no nigga treat you like that. You think that he ain't perfect for them. But she knows this nigga is. Okay. That's her twist. opinion. Plot twist. This female got friends and they all up in her ear. Is she still perfect for you? And she changed her fucking mind. Now she coming at you. My, my friend said that you shouldn't do this or you shouldn't do that. Because that happens every fucking day. Then you, then you handle that. You handle yeah. that like a man. Now but her this, curiosity is going. So you but, just but handle this, that. But this is accordingly. The so th this is what we're saying. Even if she got friends in her ear, y'all can still have a conversation, including her friends. So, you, I mean, everything is this. At the end of the day, this is how I feel. A person can be perfectly balanced for you. That person is definitely everything else that you need. Things that don't you don't. It's a it's a perspective right. that you don't normally have, and it opens it, it enlightens you whenever y'all have conversations, whenever y'all argue, whenever whatever the case may be. Y'all could be still pissed off at each other mm -hmm. at the end of the Furious. fucking argument, but you can think you um, and this is natural. You rethink about whatever y'all was arguing about, and you can see that person's perspective, and y'all could both. She probably see your perspective, and then when y'all have a conversation again, y'all come together, y'all come to a different conclusion, and then y'all move forward. Right. People can be perfect for Each you. Yeah. Period. I'm gonna definitely say you can. You can definitely find your partner. Let's, let's agree to disagree saying. on this conversation. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna agree to disagree. But it sounds like I'm not going. I'm not agreeing, but you're not trying to give in. I'm oh, not going to use the word perfect. perfect. I'm never that's gonna. Why you not gonna have no, that's understandable. Uh, it's like y'all agreeing, I'm but not, you don't want to give in. That's understandable. I'm just going to stand. That y'all click a lot. It's people that you're going to click a lot, but there's never a perfect person for you. That's what I'm saying. I would I even say that you'll definitely find a good, good person for, for you. I definitely. I'm never going to use the word perfect. That's that's I, my I whole argument. You'll find a good partner. You'll find a best friend. You'll find a great woman. If you find, if you but married, you're not, you find you're not finding friend. a perfect person, man. Bro, if you marry your perfect. best friend, I don't think there's nothing, nothing better yeah, than there's nothing that. There's, I don't feel like it. You can it's go it's not perfect. Yet. That's what I'm going to say. You can be your best friend. Bro. Best friend still... So, no, before I mean, we go, I okay. Just, so, what? what is your... Like, what's your... Your perception of perfect. What would what? I just perfect is perfect, bro. No mm, argue, nothing. No nothing. That's what I'm saying. You don't argue. You that don't perfect. fight. You y'all don't disagree. Nothing. That's perfect. Mean. That, comes that, comes that, comes off, mean. that comes off unreal. Bro, do y'all know the definition? What is perfect? That's flawless. What is perfect? That's perfect, so perfect, that's perfect, perfect too. About, flawless and perfect the same thing. They're the same thing. There's 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 no space for error in neither one. Bro, y'all. That's it, bro. Like. Y'all using the wrong bro. word. Okay, man. what if, what right if somebody right really doesn't see a, 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 a error in anything? What if the, I mean, there, and there's and it's, it, it's is it's there like real that. errors there though? It's like that. What if they don't care? They don't care. They don't. Okay, they, we, we just them. talked about that. Numb to we them. just talked about that. People got opinions all the time, and that's wrong. Uh, How you gonna tell somebody opinion? On who they dating that they're wrong. If they're if it's wrong, who the bro, fuck are you? Wrong. That's hey, listen, what I would look at it like. Who the fuck listen, are you? So this, this, what you mean? Just, just, just bro, you know what tell me because we because we'll we'll be arguing this this for like no we won't years we just it's a good time we disagree it's a good time it we'll, is but we just agreed to disagree yeah. I mean that's it we'll leave it on that we don't have to you got two that we listen. Hey, it's two and two. Two people think that it's a person perfect out there for you. Same and you got two me. people that don't think there's nobody they out there perfect for you. They think you ain't going to be dealing with hey, shit but so scumbags. In conclusion, no, 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 no,
last hit. Look at that. I got the last hit. That's what it is. Oh, man. I, I'll find uh, a good person for y'all. Only on In Your Face podcast where you get this kind of passion. Man. Welcome to the Midwest, baby. We are here. We appreciate all y'all coming in here. Are we in it? Talking? No. Well, I'm, I'm just talking. Bro. I got to. I got to go. Okay, well, before we end, I just want to say one more thing. Okay. I, just, I got one more topic to talk yeah, about. Ahead, ahead, finish, All right, finish, so finish. here we go, y'all. All right. From this day forward, I'm about to get to promoting this Guns Down, Gloves Up extra hard. It is it's, a person out there perfect for you. Last person to comment. Man. Go ahead. He lied. Finish doing what you We on this. <laughs> we, yeah, we off there. We'll agree to disagree. In, I'm uh, to yeah. Yeah, guns down, gloves up. <laughs> Would have been today, but I pushed it back two weeks, which was a good thing. So I'm getting all this stuff together. It definitely goes against gun violence because we are out here losing some good people. Nipsey, Pop Smoke, my little brother, to gun violence. Niggas somewhere on the line got in their mind that it was tougher to have a gun than this to just put your hands up. So hopefully, you know, this movement keeps going. We can influence the younger generation coming up because this middle generation, they're done for. Them niggas is weak. They want to shoot before they fight. And you're losing either way. You're either going to die or you're going to go to jail. That's it. So that's what we out there boxing for. I got my boys on In Your Face podcast. They're going to be out there boxing also. Which, well, okay, just Kales is. Matter of fact, hold on. Matter of fact, let me make it bigger. Let me make it bigger real quick. I want this year to be better than last year. And we used to box all the time when we was little. This is what we used to do. We actually had something called like tag team boxing matches. Where it'd be two versus two, boys in there scrapping. No one been in one before. You know, <laughs> I, he went against me and Kells before. Me and Kells, y'all don't know, but we, we the dream team. That's our name. Whenever we team up, we can't be beat. That's just what it is. <laughs> so, what I'm going to say is... Guns down, like gloves. What? What? What's going on? Now listen, hey, this, this is what hey, I'm Kale's saying. About to, like, listen, both of these niggas about to make me put my hands on. Hold on, time out. Now <laughs> that's what I'm trying to get to. Kells. Light work. My nigga. Kells. Kells. Hey, listen. Listen, Woo! listen, Kells. I'm talking to you. Go ahead, go ahead man. Let them get the. I would definitely thing. appreciate it, and just it, it's kind of be an honor, bro. If this is gonna be your last boxing match that we go out as the dream team. I would like it to be a main event with a 2v2. Us two, it would be tight to have it in your face podcast 2v2. That's cool. But Kevin and Milton won't want that smoke. They wouldn't. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Y'all oh, niggas speak for me so much, man. Bro, I mean, I'm just saying. This nigga speak for everybody, what? bro. I don't know what. Okay, it. first, first, before this even happened, Kels, would you give me that honor of going out with me on the two v two? I'm tired, but I know you are. This is the last year. If, if these niggas say that they gonna lose, I wouldn't do it. Y'all, y'all think y'all gonna lose? No, bro. What the fuck are you? Like? Like? Fuck, I look like. Bro, <laughs> man, shut up. Bro. Then it's on, cause they gonna get straight. <laughs> bro, I've never seen either one of y'all fight, and neither one of y'all have ever seen me fight. I don't want to do none of that shit. It's so we, that. so we can confirm the two v two for the main event. We can do that. Uh, Milton, I need to hear you say you down with it. Main can, event, two v two, Dream Team serious? versus Milton and Kevin. Y'all serious? Let's get it. Let's get it. Cool. I want that as the main event. I'm trying to make sure this is the best, best movement entertainment thing y'all done seen this I'm year. I'm out of shape too, man. All right, listen. You got two I, weeks to get it to, back, but it's sixty seconds. It's still sixty seconds. How, so how do you, <laughs> you looking at me two? like that, for? Bro, because you, you gonna get your ass scraped, bro. I'm trying to. I'm trying to save you, my nigga. We, you we, are we, out of we, shape. We literally this niggas, is, listen. I'm gonna tell you like this. Look, this is this is this, this is how it's gonna go. My nigga Kale's probably gonna swing for probably about ten seconds, and then it's gonna get ugly. Nick gonna be out there by himself, and it's gonna get real ugly. I'm trying to tell y'all how this shit's gonna go. My nigga, is, my nigga, think that hey, Kale's is gonna be a non-factor. The dream is gonna be put to sleep. Hey, it's gonna be I'll put. Be to sleep. Hey, what's my record out here, man? Go ahead and tell him my record. 2-1-0. 2-2-1-0. 2-2-1-0. What's my record? Bro, if I'm not mistaken, bro, in between that car it got ugly for you, and a couple times you didn't box with me, it got ugly for you. Bro, what? I don't know, nigga. I don't know. He lied. I don't know, man. But look, listen, all I know is this. My nigga is out of shape. 
This nigga is only, he gonna be on an island by himself. He asking for a death wish. It's like when Floyd wanna fight, I mean, uh, when Roy wanna fight Mike. I'm going for Roy, but I think it's gonna be ugly. This is what they signing up for. Bro, this is I don't wanna happen. do this. We about to jump you and Kevin I'm like, I didn't even know we started. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bro. Yeah, okay, now listen, Kevin, you ask how it go. <laughs> Honestly, if we gonna all come here and touch gloves and back up, and once you get to going, it's a 2 on 2 fight. That's it. Now, I ain't gonna do you bad to the point where it's like, Sneak you type stuff. Oh, no, 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 no. Because I was going to say, boys be on that sneaking where you and Kel square Niggas up and that. me and Milton square up Niggas and you not paying no attention to me and I just literally come and rock you. So it's kind of like you got to be aware of the other dude, but you fighting, but I ain't going to do you like that. We have a straight up 202 match. Everybody got sneak nobody. It's no, it's no Bro, sense. It don't make sense. He, he, he ain't gonna do you like that because I will. No, I don't. I don't. I don't, I don't I can't, but I, 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 like I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna. That's what I'm trying to say. Slow as fuck. Like, bro, you don't be swimming, bro. I'm not, bro. Even. Thinking about this, this is what I like. They underestimated you, which is super good. Yeah, you, 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 you used to be the underdog. You used to be the underdog. You definitely used to that. So that's good. But this ain't an underdog situation. We all know Kells is fat. What that mean? Cut it. Cut it. Cut it. My nigga got about 10 good swings in the I can see it, bro. We I'm all tired, know bro. this, bro. This I'm is tired, not. Bro. This is not a thing, bro. Well, yeah, yeah, it's nah, that, 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 that sounds like some fun, though. I'm it, with that. It's definitely I'm fun. It. It's it's definitely action packed. Oh, Boys getting it God. in. I mean, bro. The, I, I think I don't know if it was the last one we did, but me and Kels was going. I think Milton and Tracy, bro. That was wild, bro. When I tell you. I think, did I have Tracy on me? Yeah, no. Nah. No, no, what no, happened, Tracy. Me, me, me and Kels was banging. Yeah. And then, I, then I, no, 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 no. Me and Kels was banging. Look, I'm going to tell you, Tracy's a Tracy big tall a nigga, like six, 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 seven, six, something like that. <laughs> so, long story short, me and Kels getting it in. You know what I'm saying? We got the banging a little bit. Something happened to where we switched. You came to me, <laughs> and you knew you was about to get rocked up. <laughs> He took off and hit my boy. He snuck my homie. Like, my nigga, hey, listen. Listen, I swear it up. My nigga, hey, he seen what I was doing to Kels. My nigga was like, mm mm. Hey, when I tell you I came from left field, because me and Milton was like down the street, and Kels and Tracy was down the street. It's gloves. We got some gloves on. I'm about to say, man, you trying to fight. I know, I even got 16 ounce boys just for more cushion, so ain't nobody going to get hurt. Right. But, like he said, we squaring up, and I'm looking at him, bro, in the corner of my eye, I'm like, I'm about to go rock, Tracy. <laughs> <laughs> bro, when, I, when I'm telling you, I'm the fastest nigga these niggas know. He wasn't catching me at all. Bro, uh, yeah, I, I'm pure. Uh, uh, and this was when we had the long tall he team. See you? No, bro, it, I, when you sneak a nigga, you <laughs> sneak oh, no. he, he, he's, he's looking oh, yeah, at yeah, yeah. He's he looking at the He damn near had his back to him. So but it was one of them. But he, and bro, the tall white T on back in the day when boys was snapping. Nigga, my shirt <laughs> was, was snapping, bro. <laughs> hey, hey, he said that when niggas I said my shirt was flopping in the wind. You know my nigga said the 6'8", bro. Y'all tell you. I'm going to get the collar. Damn. Hey, it was a good boy. I bet you took the fuck out of here. I'm going to run like the Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I went bro. straight back to Kel, I was like, what's up? What's up? Nigga, Mill walk in, Mill run in, like, hold on, Trey, I got you, Trey. <laughs> <laughs> I got you. Yeah, my nigga was... That's how he did it. <laughs> <laughs> he came, he's like, oh, well, he knows he, he, know he got to save his boy, his boy was dizzy after that one. Like that. Oh, man, that was crucify, super fun, bro. but. Woo! Like I said, bro, I know you. I ain't gonna do you like that. Oh, no, Tracy. I'm with, fucked up. I mean, that's super fucked up. You knew Tracy? I didn't really know Tracy like that. <laughs> Not as good as I know Kevin. <laughs> that's fucked up. <laughs> but I mean, I will sneak Kevin if it's there. I'll be honest. If it's there, and I'm it's in his name. I mean, I'm, I'm gonna have to just pay attention. I mean, it's, it's, two, it's 2v2, so I mean, your oh, hands just gotta God. be on the... All right, y'all, please subscribe, man. We get at y'all the next one. Happy Monday. Peace, peace. <laughs>